All right. Thank you for joining. This is our Ask the Expert series. We have Brian Simcox from Brigham Heating and Cooling here in Brigham City. Thanks for joining us, Brian. Ah, thanks for having me, Courtney. Our topic for today, uh, Brian being from heating, uh, heating and cooling industry, HVAC systems, uh, the topic I asked him to talk about would be some simple home energy saving tips. Now, I know a lot of you right now are looking for ways to maybe uh, stretch your budgets each month, um, so that's why I've, I have Brian on. Now, we're just going to go ahead and get, get started right into the first question. Now, Brian, what are a couple things we can do right now to start saving on our energy costs at home? Well, uh, one of the main things is, is um, HVAC accounts for about 50% of our utilities, and so that's a good place to start. Um, one of the things that are the easiest is to address the airflow in the home. So it's important to make sure that uh, all the vents are open. Um, so for your furnace, you want all the vents open in the home, not, not very many of them closed. Um, and then when it comes to um, like air conditioning, you want to make sure that your, your basement vents are closed and all your air conditioning is going into the rooms that you need it upstairs. Um, and then change your air filter, you know, minimum every three months, we should be re replacing those filters. That's great. Um, I think even right now is probably a good time to change because we've got all the pollen in the air. There's a lot of contaminants getting caught in that air, air filter. So that, those are some great, uh, great tips. Now, question number two is what would give us the best bang for our dollar if we're looking at saving some energy costs? I think a lot of things that people overlook is the is the home performance. Um, everyone seems to think that let's look at the air conditioner efficiency, furnace efficiency, but that becomes uh, not as important as we make a home more efficient. So investing in good windows, doors, insulation, um, that is probably one of the best places to invest in because once you, you do that, um, you know, it performs well every day, every month it reduces your utility costs. Um, so it's a good idea. Check with your utility company to see what uh, rebates are available for upgrading your home. So um, whether that's power or gas. Great. Now, what what is your opinion on like LED lights and, and things like that? And so um, a good thing is when you put on uh, or install upgraded lighting, um, you're going to create a lot less heat. Um, with LED lighting, therefore your air conditioner doesn't have to work as hard to remove that heat um, that you that you paid for. Lower cost to run and it doesn't increase the heat in your home, so that's, that's great. Now, question number three is, the final question is, is there an optimal temperature setting for your thermostats that's more energy efficient? So um, when it comes to thermostats, obviously you want to keep your temperature um, cooler in the winter and warmer in the summer. Um, for an example, uh, me and my wife uh, had a dispute over temperature in the home. Um, she wanted 72, I wanted 74. So one day we ran it at 72, and the next day we ran it at 74, very comparable days in temperature, and we had five hours less runtime um, at, the, at the 74 degrees. So I think we compromised at 73. <laughs> That's great. So I mean, two, two degrees can make that much of a difference. Yeah, surprising. Uh, perfect. So I, I uh, uh, first of all, Brian, I want to thank you for being on our show today. I think you've given us some some simple things that we can all do today to start saving to start saving some money on our energy bills. Um, now, lastly, uh, I want to give you the opportunity, obviously, to to plug your business. How do we get a hold of you? And is there a promotion you guys are running right now? Um, yeah, the utility company and the manufacturer does recommend a yearly checkup, and that's something that we offer. Um, we have our performance um, tune-up that will um, give you a cleaning and a service uh, for $129. Um, but a lot of people opt out for the club membership, which will give you a discount, two visits a year for $180. And it gives you two of the, the better tune-ups. So, um, yeah, just give us a call. We can get you on the schedule. They get you taken care of. Perfect. And what's your telephone number for your office there? It is 435-723-2150. And you have a website. Yep. Our uh, website is brighamhvac.com. Perfect. All right. Again, thank you, Brian, for being on the show. And thank you guys for watching these shows. We're hoping to continue to bring some more content 
Um, so Brian, you have a great day. Thanks. Thank you.